What's happening guys? Mike here from Hammer Fitness. Look, I want to talk to you guys today about a very, very important topic. As you can see, I'm sweating my ass off, uh, which means I'm losing water like no tomorrow. I want to give you a few tips on how to get in your water, not only make it motivating to get in your water, but actually getting your water and how much to actually have. A lot of people don't know how much water to have. Um, which is totally understandable because how much water do you need? Rule of thumb is one liter per 25 kilos of body mass. Now that's me, let's say if I was sitting at 100, I'm actually 110, but let's say if I was sitting at 100, that's four liters minimum. No workouts and at a regular temperature that your body is climatized to. I know this is getting a bit tricky now, but let's say it is what date is it today <clears throat> it is the 30th of the 12th all right so it's almost new year's eve new year's eve tomorrow it's 31 degrees today so my body's not climatized to that i'm not used to that i'm sweating profusely i'm losing hydration which therefore means i need more water all right so just going back to the bare basics if i just needed four liters let's top that up maybe with another half a liter all right if i have a workout rule of thumb this is going off average guys so this may change towards you you really got to see how you feel and when i say water it is just water it's not including coffee it's not including soft drink it's not including anything else that's liquid i'm literally just speaking water only h2o plain and simple um rule of thumb if you have a workout it's about an hour of tense workout is one liter okay so let's say today i had a two hours of a workout temperatures about five to even 10 degrees higher than normal. All right, so I'll be looking at about five and a half liters minimum today. All right, so five and a half liters. That's not really too much to think of. As a whole, when you think about that just on the spot, that's a lot of water. That's like two and a half milk gallons of water. But if you divide that over the day, that's almost like a small cup uh, every, let's say half an hour or something. But look, Sometimes it's really unmotivating, and if you don't have the water there, then you're not going to actually make the effort to actually get up and go get the water because you know you need it. So my recommendation to you is always, always have something with you, like a bottle of water, or if you've got like, look, I'm always sitting next to this big thing. All right, so the cup's next to me, but I've always got a bottle of water anyway. Now, if you haven't got one in your office, get a bottle of water. I literally just got this bottle for Christmas. And for some reason, it is so cool that I just find it motivating to drink because just because it's a cool bottle. That's kind of like strange, isn't it? It's got a little lock, and then a little button pops open. And it's glass protected by this maybe like silicon layer. If it means getting a cool bottle for yourself because it's gonna make it more motivating for you to drink out of, do that. I don't know what it is, maybe that's just me. Um, but I reckon because of that bottle, I've drank about seven liters today. Yes, I've had to go to the toilet, and yes, I've sweated this top out. I could probably wring about a liter out of this top. But look, guys, bring a bottle, whether it be that size, whether it be that size. Oh, Jesus. Whether it be that size. All right, that's not water. That's actually amino acids. That doesn't count. It kind of does because it's, yeah, no, it doesn't count. All right, so just water. All right, so always have next to you. Just think, even set a reminder, guys. I'm going to show you this app that I have that actually sets off these little reminders uh, that says, hey, Michael, time to drink. Uh, can you see that one just there? It's called Hydrate. I'm sure there's heaps of them. It comes up like with a little uh, circle to tell you how much you've got left for the day. You chuck in the settings. Uh, but water, guys, can't express how much uh, water you need and how important it is. We are made up of 70% water. That just goes to tell you that if we're made up, if we're supposed to have an average of 70% of water in us, that's a lot of, water's pretty much like our conductivity, how our body works. If it's any less, we're gonna operate less efficiently. And if you're operating less efficiently, you're gonna feel like crap, you're gonna be mopey, you're gonna be dehydrated, you, your body's just not gonna work the way it actually should. And you wanna get those levels right up to where they should be, which is around 70%. And if our body's made up of 70% water, which is majority, then at least give it 
what your body is. I don't know if that makes sense. But that is it for today, guys. Hope that helps. Remember, one liter per 25 kilos of body mass. Get a fancy looking bottle just to make it more motivating to get your water in. Um, and even just set reminders just to make sure that you get your water in as well, whether it be with a cup or your fancy bottle, whatever it is. Get your water in, guys. You're gonna feel so much better. Bulking, cutting, maintaining, whatever it is, just living and breathing a healthy lifestyle, water is where it's at. Peace for now, guys. I'll see you in the next video.